University because after four weeks on the road to start this school year and this football season, the Tippecanoe High School football team finally playing its home opener tonight. The team has been waiting for this night while crews finish the stadium renovations at City Park. And a Red Devils senior football player is being credited for making sure the stands will be full tonight. When he realized the new bleachers at the stadium did not have enough seating, he stepped up in a big way. First at four, two news reporter Riley Phillips shows us how he jumped into action so more fans could have a seat for the team's home opener. Gordon Haas didn't want to play under the Friday night lights without his classmates cheering him on from the sidelines. So he took matters into his own hands, raising thousands of dollars in just two hours to get these bleachers ready for game day. The feeling is electric on Friday nights as fans pack the stands to cheer on the Red Devils. But students at Tippecanoe High School were not thrilled to learn their student section was going to be moved behind the end zone. So senior football player Gordon Haas decided to do something about it. People were really upset. Students were upset. So um, I got the full permission from Mr. Kramer and Mrs. Hagan to have these brought in. Gordon started a GoFundMe page at the beginning of this week, raising $4,500 in just two hours, enough money to get portable bleachers. He then worked quickly with school staff to find a vendor and have the bleachers delivered just in time for Friday night's game. Gordon says he's still in shock by all the support he received from his classmates and the community. It felt pretty good because they enjoy the game just as much as we do, if not more. Um, and they're pretty much the rock to our team. So without them, it's, it's pretty boring on a Friday night. And his head coach couldn't be more proud to see how his dedication on the field translated into something productive off the field. Gordon did all this by himself. You know, he didn't come to me and say, hey, coach, what should I do? You know, there was, there was a problem. Instead of being a part of the problem, he found a solution. And it was just, it's unbelievable what he did. Now come every home game, Gordon and his teammates will get to run out onto the field with the sound of their classmates cheering loud and proud for the Red Devils from the stands Haas helped make possible. Thank you, of course, and for all the donations. I mean, a lot of money was donated for, a, I think, a pretty good cause. And I think everyone sees that. And Gordon just can't thank his classmates and members of the community enough for their generosity. He says he's pumped and ready for their first home game of the season tonight. In Tip City, Riley Phillips, 2 News, working for you.